Well, here we go. I'm off to McDonald's for the first time in a couple of years. I don't particularly like McDonald's. In fact, I find it absolutely disgusting and revolting. But members of my family do like McDonald's. So I thought I'd treat them because, well, Sunderland got stuffed yesterday at 5 4 and it was a disgusting match. I normally find them unsatisfying, unfilling, and a waste of money. And obviously, not very healthy whatsoever. But, like I said, members of my family like McDonald's and I haven't been for a couple of years and I'm going to try out the drive through I haven't been through a drive through for about five years. So, I'm excited, not. But we'll give it a go and I'll give you my ratings on my burger and the drive through experience and it'll be at the Arneson Centre drive through McDonald's. Old McDonald had a burger. Well, here we go. I'm at McDonald's now. I'm going to head through the drive through which looks quite busy already. And I've got to find... Oh, it's a big tasty. That's a big tasty. Could I have a chicken clubhouse burger, please, with no sauces and no gherkins? What was that, sorry? A chicken clubhouse burger. With no sauces and no gherkins, please. Large fries and a cork. Oh, we don't do chicken clubhouse. Do you not? Right. Um, what kind of chicken burgers do you do then? We do chicken legend, chicken sandwich, or chicken tasty. Chicken legend like a burger, is it? Yeah. Right. Can I have a chicken legend meal, please, with their large fries and a coke? No sauce at all, please. Anything else? Um, could I have just one single burger, a large tasty burger? And Mac, what Mac flurries do you do? We have dairy milk, crunchy Oreo, cream egg or caramel. Uh, one dairy milk, please. Anything else? That's it, thanks. Just set the screen driver, thank you. Cheers. Right, let's see how long this takes to get served. See how quick they are, see how pre-made and pre-ready these burgers are. Hopefully they're nice and warm. I'm going to take mine home and review the Big Tasty and see if it is actually tasty or disgusting. And I don't mean disgusting, I mean disgusting. I'm at number two or what? Do I get the receipt of the other day? Ah, you've changed my... I'm not used to these Mac, Mac drive throughs <laughs> I'm not used to a drive through So, the first window you pay and the second window you collect your goodies and hopefully it's something nice and tasty from McDonald's and I'm going to rate McDonald's out of 10 and I'm going to rate the tasty burger out of 10 and hopefully they've improved the quality from the last time I've been when like I said I found it really unsatisfying and really unfilling and quite disgusting to be honest never had a tasty before so hopefully it lives by its name lives up to its name and it is very tasty and I'm coming to my window now, so service is quite quick and it's busy. It's a Sunday at the Yarnison Centre, Durham. It is quite busy. There's about 10 cars behind us. There's about six in front of us. And service is going quite fast. At this moment in time, I would actually promote the drive through It's probably quicker than going inside. Because the queue looks quite big inside as well. Yeah, the last time I went for a drive through was about five years ago. I think this has been the last time I'm coming through for a while as well because I'm not really into McDonald's. But here we go. Alright. Alright. Right. Right. Next one's for the food, eh? Cheers. No you bother. Window two you pay, window three, you get your drinks and Mac Flurry in window four. Comes the good stuff, the burgers hopefully. It's taking about four minutes to get this. It's quite fast service. I've got a longer journey home, so when I get home, I'll probably be cold. We've got a microwave, we can always heat it up. Yes, technology, a microwave. We've got a microwave in our house. <laughs> Anybody else got a microwave? Anybody else heard of a microwave out there? From the olden days, look at that wallet. Foster's wallet. 
Must be about a hundred year old. Just like me. Where's me burgers at? It's taken a while this. Drive down to the next window and wait five minutes. Obviously they must be making mine because nobody else must want a tasty. What comes in the tasty? I haven't got a clue. This sounded tasty so I thought I'd get one because it looks like it was tasty. The next Sunderland match at the weekend, Good Friday at Sunderland versus Doncaster. Hopefully Doncaster fans will be much more better behaved than the Coventry fans, I'm sure they will be. I mean every set of fans that have been up to Sunderland this season so far have all been great apart from the minority of Coventry fans. Doncaster, I'm sure they've got a good set of fans. Can Sunderland bounce back from that dreadful result yesterday? They can't do any worse. We've got to find some way. They must change the defence around and improve. We always do it the, the hard way. If Sunderland win the last five games on the bounce, it's still in their hands. They will get promoted. So it's not all doom and gloom, not the end of the world. Win the last five games and you get promoted. Hopefully Jack Ross can get this team motivated and playing like a team. Still no sign of my burger. Stranded at the drive through I still got no food. How long will it take? Here we go. Thank you. So have a look in there and see if we've got the chips, chips, fries, and the two burgers before we drive off. Here we go, the big tasty on its way down. My big throat. And I'll see you when I get in the house. <clears throat> well here we go, here's my big tasty. Let's have a look inside, see what it's like. There we go, burger with seeds on the bun. And what the hell is all that? No idea what kind of sauce it is. This is what used to piss me off about burgers before. Look how thin the burgers are. Very thin. Bit of lettuce. Slice of cheese. And some tomatoes. And we'll give this a taste. See if it is a big tasty or not. So here we go, I'm going to review it. There we go, that's not actually, look at the size of that compared to my head. Not actually a bad sized burger, is it really? It's quite a good size, that. Look at that. Good sized burger. Let's have a taste. I know I'm in, I'm, I'm in my loft doing it, but this is where the best lighting is. Mmm. Mmm. The burger doesn't taste quite as cardboardy that it used to taste like, but I can remember. It is a bit still a bit, it is a bit cardboardy still though. The sauce is some kind of creamy Ooh, I don't know. Peppery sauce. To be fair, the drive through wasn't too bad. People were getting served after me because they had to make this bad boy first. The Big Tasty, it's called. Like I said before, it's got this kind of. Can you say that? It's like a. I don't know what to say. It's some sort of like meal, brownish meal sauce, creamy, peppery, mushroomy type sauce. On past burgers from McDonald's, back in the olden days, I have to give it a 10 out of 10 for size. The size is really big. Like I said before, about three big size bites out of that, and that is still some burger left in there. Not even halfway yet. Like a saucer size. Saucer. Begin with a saucer. 
the lettuce and tomato taste fresh. Bag is big. I have to say, the sauce, whatever it is, this sauce, whatever it is, it's just like a wet sauce. It doesn't really taste of much at all. Very bland. I'm going to have to give some tomato sauce in this bugger. And I have to say, very poor. Four out of ten for the sauce. But the burger itself, it is quite, quite tasty. And for the size, it could be quite full. Good size burger. Now I ain't a fries person. I would never buy fries from McDonald's or fries full stop. I'm a chip, a chunky chip person. Hence why I've only bought the burger itself. But the burger itself, it is quite tasty. And it's a good size. I'm going to give it, like I say, a 10 10 for the size. 8 out of 10 for the taste. Quality wise, I'm not quite sure how good the quality would be. Because it's a McDonald's burger. Historically, they weren't very good. And not many burgers are really good for you, to be honest. Last bit left. Last bit left. I've had about seven, seven bites. All gone. Big tasty. I would recommend it. Vast improvement from the olden days. Size wise, quality wise is much bigger. I don't like the sauce. Sauce is bland. Like I find mayo bland as well. But added Heinz tomato sauce, add that to the burger and it does taste a lot better. Overall, 8 out of 10. In the olden days, a Big Mac for me was like two or four. How long I stay hungry for, full for, I don't know. I've got my tea being made downstairs now. So that's the starter. I'm now going for my tea. Hope you enjoyed the review. If you're not sure what to get from McDonald's, have a go at the Big Tasty. You won't be disappointed with the size. Quality, I couldn't tell you about, but the size, well worth it. Uh. And I recommend it, I recommend it. <laughs> the welcome belch to go with it, to say that it was quite nice, it was quite tasty. The big tasty is quite tasty, but only if you add tomato sauce. And I'll catch you next time. If you want me to review anything else, there's plenty of people out there doing this kind of thing. But if you want anything else reviewed, stick it down in the comment section and I'll give it a go. And I'll catch you for the preview of the Doncaster versus Sunderland at the Stadium of Light. Sunderland versus Doncaster at the Stadium of Light. Uh, oh, a satisfying belch, that is. The preview will be coming Monday or Tuesday, probably Tuesday, because I'm busy tomorrow, and I'll catch you then. And yes, get yourself the Mackey D's. I ain't going back for any more. That's my last Mackey D's for two years. Two years. I've been off them for a couple of years. That'll satisfy me for two years. There you go. Proof is in the pudding, and I'll catch you later. Or proof is in the, the burger. <laughs> Well, here we go. It's about 15 minutes after I've had the burger. 
and I'm feeling a little bit peckish. I'm gonna have my tea now, and the burger, I don't know if it's a sauce, it's left a really steel aftertaste in my mouth. So, while it was nice when I was eating it, and satisfying, 15 minutes later, I need to go and clean my teeth. I'll see you later. Well, now it's time for me real tea. Hey, <laughs> plenty of space left for that. <laughs>